Okay guys, so continue tayo sa age problem. So this time is uh, sum of age problem. So the sum of the age of the married couple under uh, four, four children is 40 years over the century mark. 10 years ago, the sum of the age of the couple and the eldest child and the second child is 5 decades and 5 years less than the sum of all the 6 of them. Their ages now. So the father's age is 10 times the age of the youngest while the mother's uh, age is 8 times of the youngest. So the difference between the uh, age of the second child and the sum of the age of the third and the last child is 0. So while the difference between the age of the first child and the sum of the age of the second and the last child is 0. Okay, so find their age now. So, meron tayong multiple choice. So, bali, meron tayong uh, father at mother. Yan yung couple natin. Yeah. So, father and mother then Meron tayong apat na. Uh, may, meron silang apat na anak na. So, bali, meron siyang eldest. Then, meron siyang bunso. No? So, bali, meron siyang second and third. So, meron siyang anim na persona. So, ito yun, no? Anim na persona. So, we have the father. So, I assume the father is just A. And the mother, I assume that is B. The eldest child, I assume that is C. The third child, I assume that is D. The second child, I assume that is E. And the last child, I assume that is F. Okay, so yan yung mga persona natin dito sa problem. Okay? So, sabi niya dito, uh, kunin ko muna yung statement 1. Yung ito. Kasi pag nagsusolve tayo ng age problem, no? statement, uh, statement by statement, gagawa natin ang equation yan. So, bali ganito na yan. Okay, so sa, sa statement na to, may kita natin na yung sum daw ng age nilang anim is 40 years over the century mark. So, bali meron tayong... A plus B plus C plus D plus E plus F equal equals we have uh, century mark no? that is 100 yeah? one century that is 100 years ah, yun dito uh, pinakita ko yun sa previous na video yung mga different uh, time years na modifier no? yun dito so check out nyo na lang yan okay? so bali meron tayong 100 plus 40 so, this would be our equation 1. Next. So, puntahan ko to yung statement 2. yun yung statement 2 so kukunin natin yan okay so yan no? gawa natin ng equation yan uh, 10 years ago so kalimutan mo muna na meron yan kalimutan mo muna yan ha? okay so yung sum down nung uh, age ng couple so may, meron tayong father at mother that is A plus B so, we have A plus B. Okay. So, okay na ako dito, no? Then, yung eldest child natin, meron tayong C. Okay. And then, so okay na ako dito sa eldest. Then, meron tayong second child. Second child, E. No? So, meron tayong plus E. Is. So, that is equal. So, is 5 decades 
five decades and five years less than yeah so bali five decades and five years yeah? less than the sum nung uh, all of them yeah? so yung sum nung lahat sila diba? a plus b plus c plus d plus e plus f yan yung sum no? and that is equal to uh, this is equal to convert ko na lang this equal to 140 so yun yun no? so bali meron tayo ditong uh, 140 minus yung 5 decades and 5 years so 50 yeah? decades is Uh, 10 years so so 10 times 5 no? 10 plus 5 so minus 55 okay so yan no? kaso uh, di pa natin consider yung 10 years ago so ngayon once na okay na yung equation natin diba? okay na yung equation natin eh doon na natin ilalagay yung 10 years ago so bali meron tayong 10 years ago so that is ago that is past tense so minus 10 Minus 10 Minus 10 Minus 10 So this will be now our equation 2 Yun Okay So pag simplify natin yan That becomes uh, A plus B plus C plus E And that is 140 minus 55 uh, negative 1, 2, 3, 4, apat na 10, na So, plus, minus 40. Then, transpose natin. So, plus 40. Or, A plus, simplify ko muna. A plus B plus C plus E equals 125. 125. Okay. So, ito na yung magiging equation Okay? So, yun equation to. Next. So, okay na ako dito. Uh, crush out ko lang yung tapos ko nang nagawan. So, crush out ko na to. Kasi nagawan ko na to eh. Crush out ko na yan. Nagawan na natin na equation yan. Less than the sum of the range. No? So, yung wala na lang tayo, natira na lang. No? So, gawa natin na equation to. Yung ito. So, gawa natin na equation ulit yan, ha? So, the father, I think the father, so the father's uh, age is 10 times the age of the youngest. Okay, so youngest, yung pinakabata sa kanila, na So, yung father daw, so kung gagawa natin na equation, yan, eh, ito, ito lang muna yung gawan ko. Okay? Kasi meron, gumamit siya ng while eh. No? So, yung father daw is, that is equal, 10 times the age of the youngest. The youngest is the last child. No? So, we have F. Uh, father is A. Sorry for that. Uh, father is A. I assume A. So, the father, which is A, is 10 times nung F. 10 times nung F. So, this would be our equation 3. Okay? And this one, na meron tayo dito, the mother's uh, age is 8 times the youngest. So, yung mother, that is, we assume that is B. So, therefore, that is, B is just equal to 8 times nung youngest natin. So, this is our equation 4. Okay. So, that is our equation 4. So, okay na tayo dito. Crush out ko na lang to. 
So, nagawa na natin ang equation to. Kasi medyo mahaba eh, no? Okay na yan. So, gawin ko naman ang equation yung ito. Okay. Gawin ko na equation yan. Yan yung last na statement ata yan. Okay, uh, may continuation yan eh. No? Kunin ko na lang din. Nandito na yung dot nya. So, gawin ko na equation to. gawa na natin ang equation yan so the difference between the uh, age of the second child and the sum of the age of the third and the last child is 0 so gawa natin ang equation to so hanggang dito lang ako kasi ito na gawa natin ang equation to kasi gumamit siya ng and dito so ay wait wait The difference between the age of the second child and the sum of the age of the third and the last child is zero. Ayan na. So, hinto na ako dyan kasi gumamit na siya ng while. Okay. So, parang ano yan eh. Na? So, iba, to, iba yung dito. Na? Parang ganun. So, pag ano natin yan, gawa natin ng equation yan. So, ibig sabihin, the difference between the age of the second child. So, yung second child natin is alam natin that is second child second child. Ito yan, no? So, si E. So, gawa natin yan. So, we have E is equal nung no? Ay, difference pala eh. Difference. So, minus. So, minus di, uh, minus the difference between the age of the second and the sum. So, sum nung nung third tsaka last so si third child tsaka si last third child is D tsaka si last child is F so D plus F no? D plus F so yung difference daw nito yeah, is is zero so that would be our equation 5 equation 5 Next, okay, next is the difference between the age of the first child and the sum of the age of the second and the last child is zero. So, ibig sabihin, yung difference daw ng age ni first child, so, si first child that is labeled as, ito, si eldest child, yan, yan yung first. So, C, 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 yan, na. So, we have uh, C is minus sum. So, yung sum daw ni second tsaka ni last. So, si second is si second is C E tsaka yung last cha, si last child is F. No? So, si last child is F. So, we have A plus F. So, therefore, this is equal now. Is Zero. So, this is our equation 6. Ayan. So, yung ano natin is 6. Yeah? Meron tayong 6 equations. 6 unknowns. Ay, ay, ay. No? Masakit. No? 6 equations, 6 unknowns. Sige. Solve na tayo. So, oh, ilagay ko muna lahat ng equation. Okay. Okay. 
okay okay see so we have a plus b plus c plus d plus e plus f equals 140 this is our equation one okay and clean one twelve five a plus b plus c plus e equals 125 equation 2 equation 3 okay uh, we have 10 f this is our equation 3 uh, 8 f this is our equation 4 then we have e, e ng d plus f equals 0. This is our equation 5. C minus e plus f equals 0. This is our equation 6. Okay. And then, yun na, na? So, solve na natin to. So, I combine natin yung... So, considering equation 1 and equation 2, no? A plus B plus C plus uh, D plus A plus F equals 140. And alam natin yung A plus B plus C plus E, yeah, sa equation to, Okay, ito sa equation to. So, from equation 2, so sa equation 2, this is equal to, yeah, yung A plus C plus E is equal to 125. So, therefore, this is 125 plus D plus F. D plus F equals 140 so D plus F is just equal to 140 minus 125 so D plus F is equal to 15 15 10, 2, 3, 4 1 more, okay, 15 so we have here next mm, d plus f ah oh, ito no may d plus f dito eh diba ito so pwede kong gamitin yung equation 5 so using yung equation 5 okay consider yung equation 5 I assume this is equation A ngayon this is equation uh, x na lang yan. So, 5 and x. So, bali, e minus d plus f equals 0. So, we have e minus 15 equals 0. Thus, e equals 15. 15. Okay. So, e is 15.